I'm back today um, and I wanted to do um, just a short video um, about some of my most worn nail polishes. Um, I don't I don't want to call it the most worn nail polishes of the summer. It's just my most worn nail polishes, period. Um, I love changing my nails very often. Um, so these are just a few of the colors that I use over and over and over again. Um, so yeah, let me just get started. Uh, the first one is something from um, a color from OPI. It looks like this. And this one is called um, Kiss Me on My Tulips. And I actually got this um, in a glossy box. And I love this color. It's such a vibrant, pinky, um, it's just a bright pink. It's a very true pink color. Um, if you like hot pink, it's I would say it's a little bit softer than a hot pink, but it's just really pretty on the nails. So that's Kiss Me on My Tulips. Um, the next color is something that's relatively new from Essie. Um, and it looks like this. And it's um, from their, I don't remember the name of the collection, um, but it's the color is called Penny Talk. And it's a really pretty rose gold metallic color. I love this color. I don't know that you can see the true color, but this is what it looks like. It's really, really pretty. I um, mean, I like to wear Penny Talk with Kiss Me On My Tulips together. Um, I just think that the rose gold and the hot pink is just gorgeous together. So uh, the next polish is... Um, from Revlon and it looks like this and this is one of their scented colors um, and this one is called Sugar Glaze. I don't know if you can see the true color um, but it's a, just a light pink color. It's a light pink. Um, it's really really pretty um, and it smells like donuts or some sort of candy but mostly like donuts. I love this. And this also goes well with Penny Talk. So I like these two together. Um, next is something that I'm wearing on my nails right now. Um, and it's from Zoya. And this color is an Anja. And it's gorgeous. It's this really pretty maroon color. Um, it comes out a little bit darker on the nails as you can see then in the bottle, but I like that. It's a really close to black color, but it's gorgeous. I'll be wearing this a lot. Um, something fall. I'll be wearing this a lot in the fall. Um, and I mean, I wear it like in the summer too, but definitely in the fall. Uh, next is something from Wet n Wild, and I love the Wet n Wild Mega Last colors. They last really long just like the name says um and these are only a dollar 99 um and these are actually part of the new line of their nail polishes so the brush and everything is wider which i like because i have i mean sometimes i grow my nails long but for the most part i have pretty slim fingers but even with this I hate a small brush like even with my little fingers I hate a small brush this one is really really good the brush on this is wide it's flat I don't know if you can see that so it's really really easy to apply um, it cuts down on you know um, cleanups and all that good stuff so this one is great um, it's sort of like a milky um, ballerina pink I would say um, so it's great if you don't like color colors on your manicures and you just want just something plain but just a little something um, so yeah that's good for that and the next color is another one from Wet n Wild um, and this is probably my favorite one um, I have about five or six of them but I wear this one the most um, and this one is called 2% Milk I love the name it's so cute um, and this let me show you the other one is in sugar coat 
This one is a beigey color. Um, the 2% milk is more beige. Um, it's more closer to my natural nail color than sugar coat. Sugar coat is more pink. This is what they look like together. They look exactly the same in this camera for some reason, but um, definitely 2% milk is lighter. And again, this one has the manicure, manic, manic curve pro brush. So it's really good. And these are only $1.99 in the store. So it's great to get them when Walgreens or Rite Aid or whatever drugstore you go to has like the half off on Wet n Wild. It's pretty awesome. Um, and next is my favorite, favorite, favorite H&M polish. Um, and it looks like this. And the color is blew my mind and I love this color it's not a navy blue it's um not a royal blue it's just a bright blue color and it's so pretty on the nails it's really noticeable and in the sunlight especially it's gorgeous and if I remember correctly the Persian babe Barbara she loved this color loves this color as well and I think I saw it on her first I was like oh I have to go see if I can find that um and I think the H&M polishes were $4.95. I'm not sure if you can still find Blue My Mind, but it's if you see it, definitely pick it up. And last is possibly, I don't know if it's my favorite nail polish color ever, but it's top five. Um, and it's from Essie. And it looks like this. And it's in Geranium. And this is not a new color. I'm not sure how long this color has been around. Um, but it's a perfect red-orange color. Um, it's more, um, I guess it's more orange. So it's maybe like a, instead of a red-orange, maybe like a coral orange color. But it's absolutely gorgeous. And if you have a warm skin tone like I do, or olive skin tone, it's so pretty. And if you're fair skinned, if you have a tan or if you're medium skin tone, it's so pretty on. Um, I love this on my toes. Um, this is what I've been wearing the whole summer. Um, and I just love it. It's definitely my top five. The formula is great. Um, see, I'm about halfway down the bottle, but... I just have to keep replacing this. I actually found this one on eBay because I couldn't find it anywhere in the store. So I'm going to have to go and get another bottle on eBay. But I love this. So I think that's the last one. Yeah. So those are my favorite nail colors, polishes, varnishes, whatever, lacquers, whatever you want to call them. Um, so leave me a comment below. Let me know what are some of your favorite colors. Um, for the summer, fall, spring, whenever. Um, yeah. And, um, you know, rate, subscribe. If you have any questions, let me know. Um, I'll be back with another video. I think I'm probably going to upload um, or film after this, too. So you'll be seeing more of me very soon. So thanks for watching, guys. Bye.